Colon cancer is a formidable adversary, silently lurking within the depths of our bodies, often unnoticed until it's too late. This insidious disease, characterized by the uncontrolled growth of malignant cells in the colon or rectum, can strike anyone, regardless of age, gender, or race. In this video, we will delve into the world of colon cancer, shedding light on the eight critical symptoms that should never be ignored. These symptoms serve as the body's way of sending distress signals, urging us to take action and seek medical attention before it's too late. Colon cancer is a prevalent and potentially life-threatening condition. According to the American Cancer Society, it is the third most commonly diagnosed cancer in both men and women in the United States, and it's responsible for a substantial number of cancer-related deaths worldwide. However, there is hope in the battle against this formidable foe. Early detection through the recognition of symptoms can make a world of difference in the prognosis and treatment of colon cancer. The key lies in awareness, vigilance, and timely action. So, let's embark on this journey together, exploring the eight critical colon cancer symptoms in detail. By the end of this video, you'll be well equipped with knowledge that could potentially save your life or the life of a loved one. Remember, the key to triumphing over this disease is to never ignore the warning signs. Number 1. Blood in Stool When blood appears in your stool, it could be due to a range of factors, such as hemorrhoids, anal fissures, or gastrointestinal bleeding from other sources. Hemorrhoids, swollen blood vessels in the rectum or anus, are a common cause of rectal bleeding. Similarly, anal fissures, small tears in the lining of the anus, can also result in blood in the stool. These conditions, while concerning, are generally not associated with colon cancer. On the other hand, gastrointestinal bleeding can originate from different parts of the digestive system, including the stomach, small intestine, and colon. This bleeding may be due to ulcers, diverticulosis, or even colorectal cancer. The crucial aspect is to differentiate between these causes and recognize when to seek medical attention. The type of blood in your stool can provide valuable clues. Bright red blood in the stool often suggests bleeding near the rectum or anus, such as from hemorrhoids or anal fissures. In contrast, dark, terry, or black stool may indicate bleeding further up in the digestive tract, possibly from the colon or stomach. It's important to note that blood in the stool can sometimes appear as streaks or be mixed in with the stool, making it less conspicuous. Number 2. Abdominal Pain or Discomfort Understanding the nature of the pain and its location can provide valuable clues. Abdominal pain due to colon cancer is often described as crampy, intermittent, or persistent. It can be located in the lower abdomen and may sometimes be associated with bloating. It's important to note that abdominal pain is a nonspecific symptom, which means it can occur in various conditions other than colon cancer. Gastrointestinal issues such as irritable bowel syndrome, IBS, diverticulitis, or gastritis can also lead to abdominal discomfort. In some cases, abdominal pain associated with colon cancer may be accompanied by other symptoms, such as changes in bowel habits, unexplained weight loss, or blood in the stool. These combinations of symptoms can be particularly concerning and should prompt immediate medical attention. Number 3. Unexplained Weight Loss it's essential to understand that significant weight loss without a clear explanation is not a normal occurrence. Generally, healthcare professionals consider weight loss of more than 5% of one's body weight over a span of 6 to 12 months to be unexplained. While there can be various reasons for unexplained weight loss, it's vital to consider the possibility of an underlying health issue, especially when combined with other symptoms. Colon cancer can lead to unexplained weight loss for several reasons. First, the tumor can impair the absorption of nutrients in the colon, leading to nutritional deficiencies. Additionally, the body's immune response to the cancer can increase metabolism, causing the person to burn more calories than usual. Number 4. Fatigue Fatigue associated with colon cancer is often more than just feeling tired. It can be extreme exhaustion that interferes with your daily activities and quality of life. This fatigue may be accompanied by weakness and a lack of energy. 
The connection between colon cancer and fatigue lies in the potential development of anemia, a condition characterized by a reduced number of red blood cells or a low concentration of hemoglobin in the blood. Anemia can result from colon cancer when the tumor causes bleeding in the gastrointestinal tract, leading to iron deficiency and a decrease in red blood cells. The result is a decreased ability of the blood to carry oxygen, which can lead to fatigue. Number 5. Anemia. Anemia is a condition where your blood lacks enough healthy red blood cells to carry an adequate supply of oxygen to the body's tissues. It can result from various causes, including nutritional deficiencies, chronic diseases, and bleeding disorders. One of the potential causes of anemia, especially in the context of colon cancer, is gastrointestinal bleeding. Colon cancer can lead to anemia when the tumor causes bleeding in the gastrointestinal tract. This bleeding, often unnoticed, can gradually result in a significant loss of blood, leading to a decrease in red blood cells and a reduced capacity to transport oxygen. The result is anemia. The symptoms of anemia can vary but often include fatigue, pale skin, shortness of breath, and cold hands and feet. It's essential to recognize that while anemia can be a symptom of colon cancer, it can also be caused by other health issues, such as nutritional deficiencies or chronic diseases. Number 6. Rectal Bleeding Rectal bleeding specifically refers to the presence of blood that comes from the rectum or anus. It may be noticeable on toilet paper after wiping or in the toilet bowl. The color of the blood can range from bright red to dark red, depending on its source and the time it spends in the digestive tract. Rectal bleeding can be associated with various conditions, including hemorrhoids, anal fissures, or gastrointestinal bleeding. Hemorrhoids, swollen blood vessels in the rectum or anus, are a common cause of rectal bleeding, particularly when the blood is bright red. Similarly, anal fissures, small tears in the lining of the anus, can result in rectal bleeding. However, when rectal bleeding is persistent, severe, or associated with other concerning symptoms, it should raise a red flag. It could be a sign of an underlying issue, including colon cancer. Colon cancer can cause rectal bleeding when the tumor bleeds into the colon or rectum. This bleeding can result in dark or black stools, as the blood has time to mix with stool as it travels through the digestive tract. In such cases, rectal bleeding can be a late-stage symptom of colon cancer. Number 7. Constipation Constipation is a common digestive issue that most people experience at some point in their lives. It's characterized by infrequent bowel movements, difficulty passing stool, or hard, dry stools. In many cases, constipation is a temporary problem that can be resolved with dietary and lifestyle adjustments. However, when constipation becomes chronic and is accompanied by other concerning symptoms, it should not be ignored. Chronic constipation is defined as having fewer than three bowel movements per week and experiencing these symptoms for an extended period. Colon cancer can cause chronic constipation due to the tumor's presence in the colon, which can obstruct the normal flow of stool. As a result, you may experience difficulty passing stool and a decrease in the frequency of bowel movements. It's important to distinguish between occasional constipation and chronic constipation. Occasional constipation can result from dietary choices, stress, or other temporary factors. Number 8. Diarrhea. While constipation can be a concerning symptom, the opposite, diarrhea, is equally important to consider, especially when it is persistent and unexplained. Diarrhea is characterized by frequent, loose and watery stools, and it can have various causes, including infections, dietary choices, or underlying health conditions. Colon cancer can lead to chronic diarrhea when the tumor obstructs the normal passage of stool through the colon. In such cases, the body may respond by increasing the frequency and looseness of stools, resulting in diarrhea. It's important to recognize that chronic diarrhea should not be ignored, as it can lead to dehydration and nutritional deficiencies. Chronic diarrhea can be debilitating and significantly impact your quality of life. Thank you for watching our video on critical colon cancer symptoms you should never ignore. Your health is important, and being aware of these signs can make a real difference in early detection and treatment.
However, please remember that this video is for informational purposes only and is not a substitute for professional medical advice. If you or someone you know is experiencing any of these symptoms, please consult a healthcare provider for a proper evaluation and diagnosis. Stay informed, stay healthy, and don't hesitate to seek help when needed. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel for more valuable health information, and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss an update. Thank you for being a part of our community, and we'll see you in the next video.